Good morning, all. I'm here with Shari. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Shari. And we're at this morning, and um, we're doing today winter warmies. So I'm actually in a bit of a Zara. Um, let me just show you. Um, woolen dress. It's very un me, this. There it is, like that. And it's khaki, which is not an easy color for me, Shari. Difficult to decide makeup choices. When I wear a bright blue, it's really easy. When I wear, you know, white, it's easy. But we need to brighten up. I've got a bit of sequin, so I want to be inspired by that. That. Mm -hmm. and we're just deciding what will be a good look um, and I might just put my hair up with one of the brushes multi-purpose 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 so it's about getting rid of the tiredness and um, and bring so our, our little colour palette which we've got at the moment that's the colour palette we're looking at so we're looking at a bit of sash on the lip, maybe on the eye we're looking at a bit of sunlight and then some wisdom perhaps and then some strength, which you like, Shari. I do, that's you know. my favourite one. And then blushes should it be brighter. So I'm going to hold this here, this might be easier as you do it. So okay. I am a bit tired today. So we need to get, I can lie back if that's easier for you now, just so you can, because this probably then shows what you're doing. So Shari likes to put, um, just a touch, I mean, BFF on with a brush. I do. You do, don't you? Tell me why, that's all right. I just, I think you put, I think you end up putting less on. I think you, you can control the amount okay. much better if you put it on with a brush. Right. I love that everyone does it the way that they feel best. I shove it on like it's a moisturizer. Um, I probably sometimes put a bit too much on, but then I'm too much of everything kind of person. Yes. I think also I was trained for to hygiene, just to, yeah. to not yeah. touch on my face with my fingers. Like. But I think when it's your own face, you can do what you want. Yeah. I mean, I was, even though I cleaned my hands a lot, when we were in Manchester and Birmingham last week, and I loved Me Too Ladies, they were fantastic. They were <laughs> the best women. Um, I did put my fingers on, but I always clean in between, but I was literally all over their face with my fingers. And most people, my finger just headed for them, and I think they didn't have a chance to say, excuse me. Yeah. But I, I'm very hygienic. But I had one Let lovely... Let it be known. Yeah, yeah. Let it be known she's very hygienic. I, I'm a germaphobe. <laughs> uh, but I had one lady who was um, uh, Chinese and incredible skin. You did that amazing skin because, you know, Koreans and a lot of Asian women do this eight layers of, of a skincare routine and they have skin. You just, you can't believe how good it is, can you? You never go in the sun. Incredible evenness of skin tone. So I went up to her and she had hardly, like, no makeup on. And so I went up to her and said, let me just do this. And she sort of visibly flinched. And I said, I'll be very gentle. And I think she'd been to a few makeup counters and they just tried to put a lot of stuff on. So mm -hmm. then I did it with my fingers and she kept, I, it was like, I felt she felt she was under a torturous thing. Mm -hmm. And then I showed her, boom, boom. And she was so surprised by how little makeup was on. Yeah. You know, and I think for me, I oddly, when I do a brush around my eyes, I put on too much makeup. If I do my finger, I do little and I build it up. So that's my yeah. technique, but I'm not a professional makeup artist. And you are. Oh, thank you. Yes. I try. She tries. She succeeds. <laughs> I've got a lot of hair at the moment, which I've tried to cover with colour well. But it's growing. My grey is growing through so quickly. Mm. I'm noticing it looks a bit of is a very weird... very normal? I don't know. But, I mean, I've coloured colour well there. But if we go back into the sort of prism of my hair, that's like two weeks, ten days even of growth. Goodness. I think I'm 80%. Yeah, I'm no, 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 no. What do you mean? You say that with shock or with... with... Yes, you are. <laughs> well, I would say I'm grey all around here. Probably back here, I'm not grey. But where it matters, I'm grey. In, a, in an embarrassing I've just got a nice way. Spider here. I Have you? Like a, like Look at the colour of Shari's hair. Do we think that's real hair colour, ladies? <laughs> she certainly wears it well. Let me put my glasses on whilst you're doing that bit before you get onto my eyes because I want to just um, take questions from ladies. Um, um, please do a skincare book to talk us through ingredients, brands, and stuff. I'd love to. It's on the blog, ladies. Everything I, I, I like to talk about. We put lots of details on Trini London Tea Time on at trinilondon.com. Magician on the eyes. We might. Yes, you're thinking magician on the eyes. They started telling me what they think I should do. So it's quite nice. What colours would you like to see? Sparkly top is from Zara. It's a great layering piece. Um, really good layering piece. How long would a pot of foundation last if used daily? I have used this. 
for six, six months. months. <laughs> I think it's going to last a year and a half. I wish it didn't last so long, but it does last so long. If you use very thick base, a year, but I'd say if you didn't, nearly a year and a half. Morning sunny Somerset, you're in Mauritius. That's divine for you. Do you need my eyes now? If you had to choose between Annette de Gaspé or Sisley for your moisturizer, what would you pick? That's so difficult. I wore this morning the Nanette de Gaspé purple cream, which is incredible. The rose mask from Black Rose Mask and Sisley, there is no nicer cream mask. Do you know the Black Rose Mask and Sisley? I don't think I've tried it, no. It's is it just amazing? beautiful. But the Nanette de Gaspé has a um, exfoliating toner, which Sisley doesn't have. So Nanette de Gaspé has more active ingredients. Sorry, darling. No, I'm you're doing my lip first. Thank you so much. You're just, yeah, I keep missing the lies. You put them up elsewhere later. If they're interesting, I do. I put them on Trini Time uh, on the blog at trinilondon.com. Oh, oh, we should do Chariot. Yes, Chariot we've got to do today. Oh, that's such a good idea. We've got to find Chariot. Chariot is a good Yeah, that is such a good idea. Wouldn't it be too green? Do you think it would be all too green? What if we had gold with it? What do we think? I just think the warmth. She thinks the it's warmth too green. A contrast. Yeah. I think will be better. Okay, all right. But we could do it as a wash with gold. Yeah. What do we think as a wash with gold? Um, when do you get out first fray when did you get our first fray don't know um have you ever had milia extraction i haven't my spots have always been real pustulate cystic acne or blackheads um good morning trini waiting to watch you on this morning need my daily dose darling this morning we're doing winter woolies and we got three ladies all getting their makeup done now Gorgeous looks. I'm so happy with the looks today. Such lovely models. Going to help you feel inspired to be warm. My hair's doing the same thing. Grey coming in fast around the hairline. Would I grow out and, out and grow grey? Probably not, Crystal Tips, because it's a really shitty grey. You know, some people have a salt and pepper, beautiful grey, mm -hmm. and I won't. Uh, and I'll have this kind of, like, a fox's tail, you know? That bad, dirty yellowy grey yeah so I'd say no uh, I have I too am total germphobe it's the first thing putting me off your makeup I couldn't bear somebody else's fingers on my face sorry can't even use an ATM without covering my fingertips Terry that's such a pity because they are fantastic products and I think I wonder how clean your brushes are probably if you're a proper germaphobe they're very very clean but it's surprising how dirty brushes can get and we don't realize. If you keep your fingers very clean, you're a germ folk. You might, it might be very clean for those pots. You don't have to share them with anyone. Can't find the spot blog. I put it up, it's on skincare. Um, and it is up, maybe it's going up today because on Sunday we had a makeup artist down. So Maiko, who does my blog, who's a beautiful makeup artist, did the makeup. So she didn't have time to upload the spot blog. If you're waiting for it, I think it'll be up today. Um, I look like Rebecca Ferguson. That's so funny. I see her in on the screen. I think wearing this color today too. Um, embrace the gray. If it was a nice color, I would, but it's not a nice color. Um, finally, I can't wait to be completely gray because my hair will be thicker. Your hair will be thicker. Mm, really? I've got, I've got really fine hair, so I think if it was all gray, it would be lovely and bushy. Do you think so? Yeah. That's true, actually. Mm. If you've got curly hair. Does it look, because it's more translucent. I don't know, Shari, we'll wait and see, won't we? I don't know, yeah. You don't know. Give it a um, go. Just going close up on the eye, what are you doing? So you've decided to go for what, Shari? What color? Uh, what's that, well, it was Munchkin. Munchkin, yeah. oh, munchkin. I love Munchkin. Yes. munchkin. But, but I have got a bit of strength. I'm, I'm doing a little strength. bit of strength yeah. and Munchkin together. Munchkin is our lip and cheek, and I love that tonality. Mm. I did a lot of that in Birmingham, um, sorry, of doing, that yeah. relationship of colour between your cheek, lip and eye. Yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. my the fashion, if you're at home and can watch this morning, this morning, the fashion is incredibly tonal. So I've done orange and burgundy, and then I've done teal and greeny blue, and then I've done camel and camel and white. Camel can look fantastic, actually. If you have the right colour, and generally, I always think a blonde in camel is better than a... Redhead is definitely camel is your enemy. Oh my frenemy. God, evil. Evil. It's my frenemy. Oh, yeah. 
Um, what is the, I think the warmth, yeah. the warmth of, this, of this eye with your dress, I think. That's I mean, what we I mean, need. Often red and green, dreadful, well, it's Red and green Eve, shouldn't be seen. But, oh, really? but if they're autumnal reds and greens, yeah. then they, they sit very well as friends. Okay. I kind of can get that. I think if you're going towards burgundy, I think the gold in my neckline helps. How... Well, I'm going to do a lot of looks now about you're wearing this colour, what should you wear with it? Because I think it's one thing that we do match me, so we say, what you suit. But the next stage is, I'm wearing green today, what makeup do I wear? And when you wear colours that aren't naturally your best colour, it's so important the makeup you're wearing. What is the fastest, simplest routine in the morning um, for your skin? I will do a few quick routines. All the routines I do actually don't take longer than about six or seven minutes, but I'll do some quick routines when I'm back in the office over the next few days. Can pale green eyes, yellow centers wear chariot? Yes, I think they can. Chariot's the one color where I think you can be that colored eye. And I did a lot of looks on chariot with green eyed women. I think chariot and fortune together, if you have a green eye with a lot of yellow in the middle, is really beautiful. It brings the green out more. It brings the green out more. Exactly. You just need that tip of the yellow to bring out, because if you have a little yellow inside your green eye, the more you can bring things out for the yellow, the green your eye will look, and the more alive it will look. Excuse me one moment. What do you, yes. Have a chat to Michelle. All right, darling, so having a chat to Michelle, so I'll answer some questions, ladies. Um, can you join the video, darling? I don't know how to do it at the moment. No, I really want to be really nice and fresh. Is it worth wearing sheet masks in the evening or would effects wear off by the morning? I don't have time in the morning with three kids. Okay, I'm going to swap around and show you our ladies on this morning. So here's my gorgeous model for this morning and we're going to be doing, I love it tonal, I'd love it to be glowy skin, the Shasha's grapes. We could even do a tiny bit. I think we could do a tiny bit. She's wearing orange and burgundy. So a bit more of a relationship here. So this is a bit pinky, that's a bit orangey, that's a bit goldy. So can we just get it all a bit more? So like, yeah. oh, I know, I know, I know what I want to do. Yeah. Yeah. I know what I want to do. If we took um, Katinka, yes. Sorry, I've got an idea. Oh, no, no, no. No, that's fine. I just want to try this. Sorry, I've got an idea. You've got Katinka there. I'm going to try a bit of... Can I just... Can you hold that? Yeah, sure. Whoops. I'm going to try a little bit of turn the lips off there. Close your eye down and just do a bit of this. Yes. Just to your... I mean, I have one called Katinka. I'm doing, I'm doing a very villainous face on you. Sorry, just a little bit more. Do you know, have you got Katinka here? Um, I probably, I think yeah, I have actually. I have. And I would yes. do Katinka on the yeah. eye yeah. and Katinka on the lip. This is too pink. Yes. Yeah, so okay. take that off yes. and do Katinka on the eye and the lip. Or okay. even Dahlia a bit. You could do Dahlia and Katinka mixed together would be beautiful. Okay. Because you've got to think of the burgundy and the orange. Because at the moment we can't have any pink. With the burgundy and okay. the orange, I think. And uh, hair? What are we thinking? I, think I kind of take the flat. I just kind of love it like that. <laughs> a little bit more. A bit more. We, okay. Separate yes. a bit more and bring yeah, it yeah, and make yeah. it a bit bigger. bigger. Yeah. Yeah. Make it a bit bigger. Yeah. Lovely. Perfect. All right, okay. darling. Great. There's our ladies being done. Okay, let's go back here. And there's Chris. Say hello, Chris. There he is, Chris. Oh. Never changes over 30 years. It's st staggering. <laughs> He's the, uh, Chris is the magical doctor on this morning. The witch doctor, the she witch means. Doctor. Not the magical doctor. Are you going to wear a Halloween costume, Chris? I am. I'm uh, Jekyll and Hyde tomorrow. Oh, Dr. Classic. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. You're a classic. So I'll be Dr. Chris and Mr. Steele. Fantastic. Excellent. That's, that's meant to be a secret, so don't tell anyone. Oh, do tell anyone. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes! Oh, yeah. Sorry about that. Okay, don't worry. <laughs> I haven't got a big audience. <laughs> and if you're watching this morning, don't say anything to the Sun Oops. newspaper. Whoopsie, whoopsie, doopsie. Um, that was so sweet. Um, the colour on my lips, Shari. What colour's on my lips? 
Shari, what colours? What colours are the lips? Oh, I like this, Shari. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, a little bit of Katinka. Lovely, she's having a little, a little alchemist. Melange. You're being a an melange. alchemist. There's a Halloween moment melange. going on it. A melange. A melange. A melange. <laughs> we like a melange. Um, have you ever tried Fraxel laser for the face? I have. I've done it about four times um, uh, with Dr. Seabag, with Diana at Dr. Seabag's. And Fractal is a laser which has these tiny pinpricks and it tries to change the texture of your skin and make it tighter. It's a little bit painful. Um, and I haven't done anything like that for about a year. It does work at retexturizing the skin a bit. It's quite good, Fraxel. It's more a surface skin texture thing, whereas something like an Ultra Lift is more muscle. Um, they do two different things. Um, good morning. I love your... Yes, uh, thank you, Dani. You're very funny. Always make up me smile, especially as I'm having my broken ankle. I hope your ankle gets better. What's the best eye cream? AJ, I don't usually use eye creams because I think they're a waste of money. I kind of just put my serums up to my eye um, air area. Um, what are my views about moving to a lighter hair shade um, to mask the gray growth? It's tricky because I don't suit being blonde which would be the natural way for me to go. I have made my tint one or two shades lighter than it used to be, and then that's got to grow out a bit. So I'm kind of going up two shades lighter, which is why it looks weirdly orange. But do you see there's a kind of bit there, and under here is darker. So I'm, I'm doing that a little bit, but having thick, thick, I think the trick of going lighter is still have some thick slices of darker through your hair. Um, yeah. Turn your makeup brands changed my life. Thank you, Babsy. I live in New York and my order comes in the next day. It's amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for saying that. That's lovely. Um, my lip colour is very fashion. Oh. Shari's made fashion. 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 Trini, are you still doing London headquarters? Ladies, we are doing London headquarters appointments. If you go on today, we release some more. And we are in the process of releasing more. We just stretch for manpower because we've had our pop-up stores. But we will be going back to our Thursday, Friday and Sunday appointments. So please check in with the site daily because as soon as we release them, they go and then we release some more. And it's really worth checking back in because things change every day. Um, and you can always, we might just do something where you can leave your email if you want appointments. Um, uh, Trini's lips are, yes, they are my lips. Thank you, darling. Um, are you going to make up, make it up Scotland next? You know what, Carrie, I'd love. We're going to go quite far north. Next stop is Newcastle on the 11th of November. I'm telling you all now, because I always tell you things first. And I then, I tell you what, I want to next do a pop-up in Edinburgh, Glasgow. So the more ladies who live in Scotland who can leave there, nominate the city and put up Edinburgh, Glasgow, the better because we always go to where we have the most nominations, and that's why we did Dublin, Manchester, and Birmingham next. Um, can't wait for your visit from the train. Um, Where's she, did she go back to her dressing room? Uh, eyes look amazing, the eyes are great. Shari always does the best eyes. Uh, you really do, Shari, you do fantastic eyes. She's got a f great sense of color. When is the shop up you did in Selfridges? The shop up I did in Selfridges, I've done um, the outfits on my Instagram and I did the ones I, I bought and I tried them on, on Instagram, so they're coming out slowly. But um, I, haven't, I haven't released them all yet. So the actual film of the Selfridges shop up is now on the blog without all the um, comments from people so you can see it properly. Um, could you answer my sheet mask suggestion, please? Question, please. Is it the best to use in the mornings? Sheet masks. Yes, I love a dry sheet mask. My favourites are Charlotte Tilbury, Nanette Gasp, if you can afford it. She also has Mr. Gasp. I use them in the morning. I used it this morning on the way in the bike. I put it on when I've got my motorbike helmet on and it works as I come to this morning. Thank you, darling. Uh, I think they're fantastic. You can use, and I also use them at night. They can use to be used generally dry sheet masks about three times, whichever brand you buy from. And they're really good before you go out in the evening and you feel your skin is tired. You've got a chance to change your makeup and clean your skin. So it depends when you most need it is when you should use it. 
how to style. I can't read this. I wish they'd do big cargo pants. Oh, I'm not good with cargo pants because I'm a bit pear shaped. I think cargo pants can make me a bit SpongeBob SquarePants. But I think cargo pants are best if they're slightly ankle grazers with a cool trainer and maybe like a silk shirt. I quite like that sports luxe look. Um, can you tell us the colors she used again? Her voice was away from the camera. Okay, that's fine. What we'll do is at the end of this, we'll do all the look, but do you want to just, actually you could do it now and then we can hold them up and then we're doing the brow. So, all right, on the... I need so many, I've Okay, well that's all right, it's all right. She's such a bloody painter, isn't she? Um, sorry, being painter, okay. So, well, so on the eyes, yeah. on the I eyes. used um, strength. Strength. Strength and munchkin. Okay. On the eyes. Strength and munchkin. All right, and put them up by my eye just so you can see. Yeah. So, oh, because you've, you've, you've done yeah. your siphoning, so. So, uh, that's munchkin. And then, and then that's strength. So it's a bit of aubergine and burgundy together. Aub aubergine and plum together to yes. get this kind of really pretty colour. Well, that's very warmth. nice. Autumnal warmth, yeah. And in the corners, yeah. we've got a bit of... Oh, we go. We've got a bit, a bit of, of sunlight. Of sunlight and starlight. Oh. Sunlight and starlight that mm. I've shoved together in one pot. And you put that in the corners where? Just show yeah. me. In, see, in here. Yeah. In here. And okay. then blended it this way a bit. It just gives, just gives the corners a little pop. It surely does. Just brings, very subtly, just brings yeah. them out. And gets that, rid of that darkness. Mm. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. Okay. Um, on the um, cheek. The cheeks I did quite a bit. Back on. <sighs> okay. And Trini hates. The no, I did. I love it. But you did. You did. No, that's fine. Shall I used Sasha. Really? Yeah. A bit of Shasha. So Sasha is lip love, which is there. Yes. Shasha is the orangey one there. And and a little bit of Freddy. So I actually put three things together. But oh you. My God. But you probably, you probably don't need to do that. You probably just don't need the Freddy. Yeah, you could do the Shasha. You could, you could do the Shasha and... Or you, or you could do Freddy with Shasha. Freddy with Shasha. I just thought Shasha was, is a bit too orangey yeah. with the autumnal look today. Okay, but, it, but the Shasha gives the brightness yeah. and then the munchkin or the, or the, um, the, Sasha, the Sasha brings it together with a bit more softness. Yes. Yeah, and Ooh. on the lip. I know it's going to be a few. <laughs> the lip was Katinka with a little bit of. Oh, I think. No, what did I use? What did I use? You did use a bit of. You did use I did, a bit didn't of. Um, I used a bit of Freddy. Bit of Freddy yeah. with a little bit of Katinka over yeah, the top. That's great. Okay. Fantastic. Yeah. All right, so that gives us an idea of everything. And then I've got here the um, we can use face finish, which is sorry, one of them. It's going to be here somewhere. We've got so many pots here. Yeah, that one. It's called something. But I just would use that. That's it. Just take off the shine at mm -hmm. the end. And yeah. now we're doing a bit of um, a bit of. I'm just doing a little bit of brow. There we go. And there's a I lovely sound. Two minutes, to the, oh, two minutes to the break. Okay. All right. We need lovely drink. Two minutes break. Ladies, I've got to go. I'm sorry I can't ask all the questions, but this gives you an idea of the look. Shari, thank you so much for doing my look. And we'll catch up later. And I'll list in the stories all the products we used. Thanks. Bye.